Hey guys, it's Onye, and um, I am here with a first impressions video. So if you follow me on Instagram, I recently posted about, you know, how Arjuni closed their door, and I feel like that left a void for a lot of people because Arjuni was one of those companies that you can go to for quality hair that wasn't too expensive, but even if it was on the more pricey side, it was reliable. Like, I left Arjuni back in 2012. And I still have the same hair extensions and I think they look pretty amazing to be five years old. So I took it upon myself to find different hair companies that provide quality hair without breaking the bank because some of us have debt. I got debt. Ain't no shame, you know? So I do try to find hair extension companies that offer quality for affordable prices. That brings me to the point of this video. I was fortunate to have the opportunity to receive some hair from Privileged Hair Extension. I've actually been following them for a while because I know quality when I see it. And so when I saw them on Instagram, I was like, yo, there's something going on here that I need to be a part of. So I'm so excited to be reviewing their hair. Um, this video is just going to be a first impressions video. So I'm just going to walk you through some of the key points of the company, show you the hair. And then the next follow up video will be what they'd installed. So here we go. Okay, so let's just hop right into this. Um, this is the package that I received, and I'm showing you guys this little box because I think it's important. I've received hair packages from companies that had branding like all over the outside box. That doesn't work for me. No. Based on where I live, that's a liability because people will see that and try to steal it. So I appreciate this white plain box. You know, no branding. Thank you, Privileged Hair Extensions. I appreciate the little things. Okay, enough of my foolishness, on to the good stuff. So, when you open it up, there is another box inside. All right, this might be too much detail, but I'm kind of excited. So here is the main attraction. Privileged Hair Extensions. And then you open it up, and inside, there's a cute little note card, and then, they also include some skin hair care argon oil. You can never have too much argon oil. No, no, no. And now for the main event, the hair. So this is what the hair comes in. A nice little leather situation. I honestly was impressed before I even opened this up because I feel like a lot of hair companies, they kind of just throw the hair into the bag. That's fine. You know, sometimes the hair just speaks for itself, but when a company goes to like this length to like really put thought, effort, and some coins into their packaging, that says a lot and I'm very impressed. So you open this up and there's the hair sitting nice and pretty. Now it looked a lot better. It looked a lot better than this when I received it, but you know, I had to take it out and have my way with it before recording this video. So forgive me, it does look a lot nicer than this when it comes. But I have four individual bundles in here, all twisted up. So I'm going to take each one out and just walk you guys through the specs. So it comes twisted up like this, and each one has a label on it. Um, on the back, that's branded for the chair. So this one, um, it says the pattern is D curly, 17 inches, and 3.4 ounces. Now I can tell right away whether or not hair extensions are going to be my best friend or if they're going to ruin my life and make me pray for the second coming of Jesus. This hair from Privileged Hair Extensions thus far gets a thumbs up for me. First of all, it smells like heaven on earth, okay? Truly, it smells amazing. I don't know what they put in here, but I love it. You know how you get some hair extensions and it smells like it's been in the warehouse under somebody's armpit? I don't know what that's about, but yeah, you gotta work on it. Anyway, so smells really good. Right out the bat, I can run my fingers through it. Very minimal shedding, like maybe one or two strands, which, you know, isn't bad. I haven't washed this hair extensions, but I can kind of tell that if you're thinking about Argini patterns, this is more like between a C and a D, but they have classified it as a D, so maybe, you know, it'll surprise me when I wash it. But right now, it's looking like it's going to be more C-ish than D-ish, because this is D that I have in my hair from Argini. So I don't know. We'll see. I'm really excited to watch this. So that's the first bundle. Second bundle, kind of a similar pattern. Kind of a similar pattern. So 16 inches, 2.24 ounces. 
Y'all even know how excited I am about this hair because I can tell it's going to be good. It's going to be good. Okay, third bundle, um, curly 16 inches, 1.44 ounces. And last but not least, we have, you see how easily that shakes apart? No tangling. Y'all, I'm ready. My head is ready. So yeah, 16 inches, 2.5 ounces. In total, I don't know. I'm not going to try to calculate that, but I think it's about maybe like 8 or 9 ounces. I have the correct information down below. I just, I'm not a human calculator, so deal with me. So that's that. Um, like I said, I'm going to wash his hair, see how it performs. I like to let my hair air dry, especially when I first get it, because I feel like you get the true, true, true pattern when you let it air dry lying down on a flat surface. Because when you hang it up or if you blow dry it, I feel like it kind of impacts the natural pattern. So because I want to show you guys the hair in its most natural state, I'm going to wash it, lay it out, and let it air dry. And that takes... Um, maybe one to two days to completely air dry. So that's why it's a two part video. Sorry guys. So here it is washed. Um, I hope you guys can see that. Um, it has really nice ringlets. Pretty much what I did was I used a clarifying shampoo. Um, I think the hair was pretty clean when I got it, but um, the best time to see how a hair is gonna perform, if whether it's gonna shed, tango, ruin your entire life, is when you wash the hair. Because if a hair is going to tangle, it's going to really tangle when it's wet. So I had a really good experience washing this hair. No tangling, very minimal shedding. Here is, this is the amount of hair that I lost. I hope you guys can see that. Get a little closer. It's about maybe 10 or so strands, which honestly is kind of normal. Um, nothing excessive. And as I said, I think this is going to turn out to be like a thumb size curl. But when this dries, it's going to be so gorgeous. I cannot wait to show you. Alright guys, that is all she wrote for this video. I am done. Thank you so much for staying tuned and watching through the very end. I can't wait to get this hair installed, play around with it a little bit, and come back with the final review. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, like, comment. What's the last one? Ah, subscribe. <laughs> Bye.